do you have some some struggles or, or kind of you know triumphs associated with those struggles that you could share with us from your journey? Sure. Um, so I will say that you look at me and you might not realize that I do a lot of things scared. So um, uh, most of what I've done in my, especially my professional career, I've struggled with imposter syndrome. I haven't felt like I belonged at the table and you know, people will always kind of say in a sort of like half joking way, just grab a seat and you know, come to the table. Well, not all of us sort of move and navigate that way. Um, I have to do a lot of self-talk about belonging. Um, and I think that's really important because sometimes we don't try things because we will be the first people to self-sabotage and put a ceiling on our potential. So that's one thing. And then I've had moments where, you know, I think sometimes um, unwittingly and maybe not so unwittingly, there have been people who have made me feel like I didn't belong. And how does one, you know, persevere, remain resilient? And it's very, very important to me to maintain my internal weather and to show up authentically, show up as a person who wants to work with others, that's very, very important. And I think those experiences have made me the person I am today. I'm not saying I have arrived, um, I'm always learning and growing. And so, um, yeah, I don't know if that's what you were looking for. But Absolutely, well, you know, I find parallels between what you're doing and being a creator, content creator, and I think, I think courage is one of them. Thank <laughs> you.